Hello. Testing sound. One, two. Hello, teacher. Caleb Good here. Evening. Who is there? <laughs> Caleb here. Who is there? Josue here. <laughs> I like that. All right, Josue, how's Lucy you doing? How, here. You, how ah. you doing? Hello, Lucia. How you doing tonight? Doing well? How are yeah, you? Teacher. I'm fine, teacher. Um, How about you, Josh? I missed you yesterday, bro. I missed you. Hi, good, teacher. And you? I'm great. I'm doing just great. I missed you yesterday in the class. Yes. Uh, I apologize. Oh, no problem. I think is I think is the first time you are absent. It's correct? Correct. Is the first time you are absent. So I don't think it's a problem, okay? Okay, teacher. So what's up? What's new, man? Everything okay? It's okay. Work is okay. Personal life is okay. It's okay. All is okay. Everything. Everything. Everything is okay. Everything is all right. Repeat. Everything is all Everything right. Is Everything all right. is all right. So far, so good. Hello, Bic. Kali is. How you doing? Good evening, teacher. What's up? How are you? How are you? Not bad, man. Not bad. I like the weather. Do you like the weather? Weather? Do you like the weather? Remember? Yes. Weather? No remember. I don't remember. Repeat. I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't weather, remember. Weather, Victor, I don't remember. weather includes when it's hot, when it's cold, Tropical. when it's raining. Weather. Uh -huh. I like the weather today. Clima. Del clima. Ah, lo entendí un poquito. <laughs> All right. Esa es una pregunta que podemos incluir en el drill que tenemos para el viernes. Right? Bueno. Les decía que una de las mejores formas que ustedes se pueden preparar es haciendo un questionary. Pueden hacer un questionary de todo lo que hemos visto, right? Desde el saludo, desde presentarse. ¿Cuál es la primera pregunta al presentarse? Who are you? How are you? How are you? Mm. Who are you? Hello, how are you? Excuse me. Mm -hmm. okay. What's your name? What's your name? Victor is in the house. Victor is in the house, people. <laughs> What's your name? Hey, hey, Hello, my me. name is. Uh, what uh, is your, what's name? your name? Ah, hi, my name is what? Lucia. Uh, my name is Lucia. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. All right. Ahí viene el saludo. How are you today? Oh, ahí viene el saludo. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. I'm Luego fine. de todo and eso, you, right? And you, teacher? Awesome. <laughs> I'm doing awesome. Luego de ahí vienen todas las preguntas. Hey, excuse me, um, where are you from? What would you answer, Josh? Where are you from? I'm, I'm from is um, Soyapango City. <laughs> That's not correct. What would, oh, you, what would you answer, Josh? It's oh, oh, oh. I live in from El Salvador. I am from El Salvador. I am Salvador. from El Salvador. Repeat. I'm from, I'm from El, Salvador. El Salvador. Live is not the question, Manuel. Live is different. Oh. Yes? Because, for example, I am from Santa Ana City. But I live in San Salvador City. Do you understand? Mm, I, I am from... In, in Chalatenango is in on. In on. No se pueden muchas preposiciones ahí. 
in. ¿Cuál es la preposición correcta ahí? From. In. In. From. From Chalatenango. I'm from Chalatenango. I sería ahí. I live in. In. In live. I live. I live Soyapango City. And the preposition? You you need a preposition. At? In. 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 In, in Soyapango City. Okay. I am from Chalatenango. I live in Soyapango Bronx. Okay. Soyapango Hills. Right? No. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Hey, good job. Good job. ¿Qué otra pregunta podemos incluir ahí? Desde el inicio, right? A ver. Have you, have you work? How or where? Where do you work? Excellent. Repeat. Where do you work? Repeat, where, Victor. Where do where you work, do classmates? You work? Where do you work? Where do you work, classmates? Classmates. Classmates. Because it's for where everybody. Yeah, it's for Noel, it's for Lucia, it's for Douglas. Repeat. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where do you work? Where do you work, guys? Where do you work? Where do you work, guys? I work in San Salvador. No. I, I, I work. Company. I am a manager. Company. Uh, company. In Company's M name. M. Kadir. I work. How do you? I work. I work in M. Kadir. In in o oh, on where donde traba no remember okay 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 let's listen to your classmates what would you say victor where do you work victor i am work i am work the question is where do you work donde traba what is the verb I work work i work i, I work. work repeat i, I work, work. I work, I work, I work, I work, uh, I work in Almacen Epidri. Okay, okay, it's valid. Se escuchó, Lucy, es válido. Yes. Aunque in, in, hay otra in. preposición que sería la ideal. Who knows? At. At, decía At. yo, porque os dijo usted que un lugar grande. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Right. La Sería mejor at. At. Mm -hmm. How about you, Lucia? Um, how about you? Um, how about you, Lucia? Repeat, guys. How about you? How about you? How about you, Lucia? Okay. Lucia. We have a translator over there, you see? Victor is translating you. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Qué digo ahí? La misma pregunta para usted, Lucía. Correcto. Les decía que esta pregunta quiero que le saquemos brillo, guys. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Where's the... How about... How about you, Jose Cruz? How Jose about? Cruz. How, how about? How, how about you, Jose Cruz? How about you? I work how about at you? Young Juan El Salvador, Olocuelta. Young Juan. Young Juan. Young Juan. Nice. Nice. It's a company, co Korean company. It's a Korean. Wait, wait, wait. Did you say Olocuelta? Yes. Oh, my gosh. Big, I need to be there. The, 65 you... uh, kilometers. 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 From from San Salvador. Uh, or uh, turn or, or, or pico. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So Yon One, it's a Korean company. Yes. Okay, okay, you... okay. How about you? How about you? How about it's you, Douglas? Your... It's your con customer. It's your customer. Vaya, ¿qué otra pregunta podemos incluir? ¿Qué otra pregunta? Uh, how do you do? Mm, what do you do? What do you do? What do you do? do, you do? Repeat. What do you do? 
What do you do? What do you do? A ver todos. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? La forma normal. What do you do? What do you do? Deducted, deducted form. What do you do? What do you do? Repeat. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Yo les puedo decir lentamente a ustedes, right? What do you do, guys? But an American, a gringo, they will say, hey, what do you do, What man? do you do? Hey, what do you do? Me. What do you do for a living? <laughs> Incluso, what's your job? Repeat, what's your job? What's your job? What's? What's your job? Your or your? Your. 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 What's? Your job. Yeah. What's your what job? Your Repeat. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What's what your you job? What's your job? What's what? What's, what's, what's your job? What do you do? I am an English teacher. What's your job? What about you, Josh? I am a pattern maker. I am a pattern maker. I am a pattern maker. Pattern, pattern maker. I am a, don't forget the article, a, uno, a, una. I am a pattern a maker. Pattern. Pass the question. Could you pass the question, Josh, to a different classmate? Uh, excuse me, Luz. Mm -hmm. This is interesting. A uh, question for you. Yes. What do you What do you do? I. What do you I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh. Is that correct? Yeah. You do, do you understand job? Job, J-O-B? Do you know what that is? Uh, okay. Uh, I am a uh, development. Developer. Developer. You're, you're a developer? Yes. Okay. Pass the question. How about you? How about you? Do solo. How about you, Victor? How about you, Victor? Uh -huh. How about you, Victor? I. Oh uh oh. I am. You're sleepy. Huh? I am a. I am a. I am. I am a manager. Nice. I am a manager. Repeat. I am a manager. I am a manager. I am a. I am a manager. Pass the question, Vic. Pass the question. How about you, Douglas Sanchez? How about you? Intonation. How about you? How about you? How about, How about you? How it about is not How about you? I am a quality event. I am a quality event coordinator. Thank you for the thank you for the question. Say I am a quality am event quality. Quality. coordinator. Okay. Yes. How about you? How about, how about you? you? Uh, how about you? How, how about you? How about you? Um 
I. <laughs> yes, yes. How about you, Ivan? Well, in English, is Ivan. How about Ivan. you, Ivan? Ivan. How, how about you, Ivan? What you do? What you do? The question is, what do you do, guys? That's the question. What's what? your job? Welcome to the class, everyone. What's your job? I am an English teacher. Hey, what what does what did you do? Class, what does Victor do? Do you remember? Third person. What does Victor do? Do you remember? He is. He's a manager. 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 Okay. Okay. Vamos a hablar de intonation. Cuando estén haciendo las preguntas, guys, tienen que jugar con su entonación. Ustedes tienen que ya, como manejan bastante información, cuando hablan, tienen que ir jugando ya con su intonation. La entonación les permite a ustedes eh, ser mejor comprendidos um, el, de lo que están expresando, ¿verdad? En cambio, uh, si no pronunciamos bien, pues la otra persona puede que quede como que confundida, right? So let's check this out. You can see my screen, can you? Can you see my screen? Two puedes. Two puedes uh, per mi pantalla. Yeah. <laughs> Can you see my screen? Yes or no? No. Hi, everyone. No? It... no? Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. 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 I can see. Oh, okay. 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 In this class, you learn about rising and falling intonation in yes or no questions What's your and WH questions. Let's get started by understanding intonation. Pitch is raising and lowering the tone of voice while speaking. The use of pitch is called intonation. Understanding English intonation will increase not only your spoken English competency, but your English comprehension as well. Intonation is used to convey meaning. For example, you have the same set of words in two separate sentences, but in one the meaning may be different than in the other due to intonation. In this class, we'll focus on yes or no questions and WH questions and how intonation gives meaning. Let's listen and practice. Notice the intonation of yes or no and WH questions. Is she getting up? Repeat. Is she getting up? Is she getting up? Is she getting Is up? She getting up? Is she getting up? That is rising intonation. The intonation goes up. Yeah? Repeat. Is she getting up? Is she getting up? Yeah. An affirmation intonation is different. She is getting up. Hmm? She is getting up in this moment. In this moment. Negative. She's not. She's not getting up. It's negative. She's not getting up. But it's a question. Is she getting up? Repeat. Is she getting up? 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 What is the possible answer? Affirmative? Negative. Yes, she is. Repeat. Yes, she is. Yes, yes she is. is. This is affirmative. Is. Negative? No, she's not. No, she's not. No, she's not. Listen. She, she's Are in, they sleeping? Are 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 they, Are they sleeping? Repeat. Is she getting up? Is she getting up? Are they sleeping? 
are they, are they, are they sleeping? sleeping? Affirmative. What is the affirmative answer? Yes. Yes, they are. Yes, yes they, they are. Repeat. They are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Negative. Yes. No. No, no, they, no, they are. are. They are. Good they job. Aren't. No, they aren't. They aren't. Very good. Now let's go with falling intonation. The intonation goes down. Yes. Falling intonation. Repeat. What's she doing? What's she doing? What's she doing? What's she doing? doing? What's she 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 doing? Wait, wait. What's she doing? What are they doing? What's she doing? What are they doing? What are they doing? What are they doing? What are they doing? What, what are, are they, they doing? doing? Thank what are they you, doing? folks. Practice repetition in your house, right? Practice repeating the information, okay? Let's go over the attendance. Let's go over the attendance. Let me know by saying I'm here. Here I am. Let me start with Douglas Humberto Sanchez Diaz. I am here. Already. Um, Hugo Ezequiel Deras Mauricio. I am here. All right. It is Yvette Saldana, Saldana Lever, Leonard Dugan. Present. Miss Ivan Armando Mendes Parada. Jose Heriberto Cruz Amaya. Josue Balmore Cruz Montano. I am here. Thank you. Let's see. Okay. And Juan Ramon Navarro Diaz. Here. Thank you. Kathleen Stephanie Portillo de Lorenzana. Present teacher. All right. Good evening. Lucia del Carmen Ayala Mejia. Present teacher. Luz Marlene Cornejo Alvarez. Present. Melvin Rafael Diaz Mijango. Present teacher. Good evening. And Noel Good evening. Ernesto Vega Diaz. Present. All right, Noah. Oscar Armando Flores Rodriguez. Present, teacher. Roberto Antonio Ramirez Gonzalez. Nope. Ronnie Osvaldo Claros Flamenco. Present, teacher. Susana Carolina Alfaro Gomez. Victor Manuel Andrade Galez. Victor? Hey, Victor, can you stay Present. today the last 10 minutes after the class in the coaching session? Yes. Is possible for you? Yes. 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 All right. All right. Thank you, sir. Let's go with Jocelyn Lisbeth Angel Inglés. Present. All right, Miss Jocelyn. Tomorrow is your turn, Jocelyn. Tomorrow, 10 minutes after the class, okay? Let's see. Carlos Eduardo Gomez. No, tomorrow. Tomorrow is your ah, okay. turn. Ah, okay. Bueno. Just for you to <laughs> consider that, please. How about Carlos Eduardo Gomez Gomez? Reina Mercedes Altagracia Barrientos. Carla yeah. Lisette Valladares Flamenco. Present teacher. Jeanette Esmenay Guzman Rosa. All right, that's it. Thank you so much. Thank teacher, you so much. Yes? Teacher, Ivan is writing in the chat. Oh, yeah? Yes. Oh, Jose Riverto is here with all the powers. Oh, my goodness. I didn't see that. Oh, that was, that was Jose Riverto, right? Yes, yes. Only him, right? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, let's switch to Spanish. Let's switch to Spanish. Ok, eh, quiero que uh, uh, usemos estos cinco minutos para hablar de las expectativas de nuestra presentación, guys. Este viernes, right, tienen ustedes eh, un uh, role play que tienen que hacer con sus compañeros, right, de 90 segundos, donde ustedes van a demostrar todo lo que han aprendido durante las clases with Teacher Caleb Núñez, all right. So, 
fácil, va a ser bien fácil porque uh, no va a ser ni individual, ni va a ser en parejas, ¿verdad? Va a ser en grupos. ¿Cómo va a ser? Va a ser en grupos de cuatro. ¿Ok? Sin embargo, los grupos siempre van a ser random. Es decir, voy a decir, por ejemplo, el viernes, Víctor, Reina, Heriberto, en luz. Go. Right? Y comienzan sus 90 segundos ahí y ustedes comienzan a saludarse, a decirse las preguntas en inglés, hacerse preguntas en terceras personas, yes, no questions, eh, WH word questions, todo lo que ustedes han aprendido. Entonces, lo importante es que como vamos a ir en grupo, si alguien pues se me traba, ahí está el otro compañero que me le puede ayudar, ¿verdad? Entonces, como equipo, vamos a ayudarnos. Y pues ahora, antes de la clase, vamos a hacer nuestro primer drill antes de que termine la clase. I'm sorry, my Spanish. <ríe> vamos a hacer nuestro primer drill para irnos como que preparando con esa mecánica del viernes, ¿ok? No tengan miedo, guys. No tengan miedo que esto es, eh, estamos aprendiendo y esto es parte del proceso, ¿verdad? Así como ustedes hacen sus tareas, así como ustedes practican, ¿verdad? Con sus compañeros, con sus familiares, eh, así como ustedes oyen música, ven películas en inglés, andan su teléfono en inglés, ¿verdad? Todo eso es parte de, entonces... Eh, esto también es sacarlos de su zona de confort. Acuérdense que el teacher no, no siempre tiene que ser el único que esté pues eh, hablando, ¿verdad? Si ustedes son los protagonistas. ¿Tienen alguna pregunta de la tarea? Bueno, de la presentación, de los role plays. How cool. Entonces, es clear like... It's clear like crystal water. Yes. Okay. okay. No questions. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. Let me go to the class then. Let me go directly to the class. Um, let's see. Yesterday, we practiced some questions. Remember? WH questions. We use when. Yes. We use what or what time yes we use who we use where etc 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 so today we're going to put those questions in practice si todavía tienen esas preguntas ahí en sus apuntes pueden irlas eh, sacando right? we're going to have a practice now most important is for you to speak in english <laughs> Okay, this is the activity. Questions and prepositions of time. The objective is to make questions and to use prepositions of times. Do you remember what are the prepositions of time? Uh-huh. What are the prepositions of time? At. At. On it. On, 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 on. At. That's correct. That's correct. Okay, so interview, entrevista. Interview a partner about his or her activity on a typical work day. On a typical day at work. Using information questions. Remember the information questions? Um These ones, the ones we practiced yesterday. Yeah? Why? What, when, where, all of that. So we're going to do it here. It says, what are about, about his or her activities on a typical day at work? Using information questions and prepositions of time. For example, for example, I have a question for, let me see. Ramon, can you hear me, Ramon? Can you hear me? No. Okay. Can you hear me, Douglas? Yes, yes. Okay. I have a quick Hello. question for you. When, uh, when do you have meetings at work? I, Listen to my preposition. 
listen to my preposition and try to use a preposition too, okay? Okay. Listen. I have, I have a meeting on Sunday and Friday. Marlene, watch your microphone. Wait, 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 wait. I have more microphones here activated, Douglas. I'm sorry. Okay. 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 Can you repeat your, your answer, please, Douglas? I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, I have a meeting uh, every, every Monday and Friday in the morning. Exactly at 9 a.m. A.m. Very well, outstanding at 9 a.m. Okay, every Friday, you say every Friday? Every, every Friday. Yes. And what if, can you try to use a preposition with, with that? On, on Friday. Correct, you can say I have a meeting I have a meeting every week, right? On Fridays at 9 okay. a.m. Remember, try to use prepositions. Can you make, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna practice. Primero voy a practicar yo mis preguntas, right? Y ustedes vayan haciendo las suyas mientras vamos haciendo la práctica. Eh, modifiquenlas ahí, porque después van ustedes, right? Primero yo, right? Quiero darme gusto ahorita con ustedes, okay? Si no están listos, solo me dicen next. Perdonen, guys, que los vaya exprimiendo, pero cada vez es more pressure for you. Ha, ha, ha. So, my question is for Josué. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Tell me. Okay. Tell me. Um, okay. The question is, who do you work with? Who do you work with? With the uh, semana, semana. Try to use your English. Try to use your English. Con quien? Con quien trabaja? Ah. Ahí. Eh, no entiendo muy bien la la pregunta, teacher. Es con quién es trabajo? That's correct. That's correct. You okay. understand? En ese caso tendría que dar los nombres de las personas o Correct. Who who asks for person? Yes. yes? I I work with uh, Daniel Florentino and uh, Herson Baria. They they are my uh, uh, work, work, co-workers, co-workers. Excellent job. A ver, ¿cuál era la preposición ahí? Como estábamos hablando de personas. With. With. Excellent answer, Josué. I work with. Such and such person, such and such I work with. Okay. Okay. Attention. My question is to Hugo Deras. Can you hear me, sir? Yes, teacher. That's me. I have I have a double question for you. Okay. Are you ready? I hope so. Where mm -hmm. and how? Do you go on vacation? Listen to that. It's two in one. Where? Me, repeat, please. Where? <laughs> where? Yes. And how do yes. you go on vacation? Okay. Uh, my vacation. I I go to the park. Uh huh. Um, how how the answer is 
Mm, maybe walk, walk in the in the park, in the in the forest, for example. I yes. I I I go to the right. beach. And, and I go to the bus. Con el transporte, vaya. Ajá, es que ahí no, quería no. llegar, pero... pero the bus o, o my pero car. Hugo se, se, se escapó bien ahí, porque a pie, <ríe> ¿verdad? Entonces, on foot. <ríe> on foot, ¿verdad? A pie, chicos. A pie. On, on foot. foot. I go to the supermarket. Oh. On foot. On foot. Yes. I visit my father on foot. Motorcycle. Va, a eso vamos. Yeah. Si, tuviera, si hubiera sido transportation, porque la, la segunda pregunta era how do how? you, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo? Entonces, ¿cómo? ¿Cómo? Mm -hmm. Entonces, cuando usemos eh, transportation, la preposición va a ser by. Ok, guys? Bye. Be right. as in boy, why as in yes. Yes. Vamos a usar by plus transportation. Oops. By motorcycle. Correct. By motorcycle. ¿Cómo sería entonces completa? I go to the park. By motorcycle. Correct. In. Bye, what is the bye. correct preposition? Bye, Cada preposición tiene su uso. Yes. Vayan poniendo ahí la preposición y su uso. Right? At es con time, que es lo que vimos ayer, right? Pone by my car. Estaría bien. By my car está bien. By my car, sí. Está bien porque siempre estás usando by. Uh -huh. Teacher. Yes. How do you write a uh, old food? A what? F O O. Oh, on foot. F -O -O yes. Pie. Mira. Bien, bien te entendió el, el compañero. Yo no te pude entender. ¿no? <laughs> nice job. Nice job. Ok. Good job. Okay, thanks. Next question. Next question. Let me see. Next question goes. Uy, ya me voy aquí. I'm sorry. Ya muchos caballeros, ¿verdad? Vamos a escuchar a las ladies. Ladies power. Let me see. <laughs> Let me go with me. Reina. What about Reina? Can you hear me, Reina? Yes. Okay. The question is What time do you talk to customers? Repeat. Sure. What time do you talk to customers? Um, what do you mean talk? Do you do you need any help? Do you need help? Yes. Somebody understands? Somebody can help her? What time do mm -hmm. you talk? to customers. Talk. Talk is a, is a C. No. How do, you, how do you spell talk, talk class? How do you talk. spell talk? T-O-O-K. No. 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 T-A-L-K. What do you mean? T-A-L-K. Oh, okay. Talk, um, conversation. Talk. Have a conversation. Okay. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. Yes. Capich. Okay. Go. Repeat the question, please. Sure. Sir. Repeat the question, guys. Who has it? Please, please. Who has what it? What time do you, do you talk? Do you talk with to customers? customers? What time do you talk with customer? Two. Two. No. Oh, hola. 
What time? What time, see, see, you, see. what time do you talk with customer? Yes, Reina, no, go ahead. No escuché, no escuché muy bien. Okay, so you eh, have a little problem. Eh, okay, eh, no problem. Este, I'm, eh, I, I talk with my customer um, um, eight, eight, um, eight, uh, at the afternoon. That is somewhat correct. It's somewhat correct. I talk, I talk with my customer at 8 a.m. At 8 a.m. Correct. At 8 At 8 a.m. A. 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 A is in alpha. The preposition. What preposition? At. at. Okay. I need you. Okay. I need you to use the prepositions. Al ustedes mm -hmm. usar las preposiciones, se les escucha un, un inglés, right? Intermedio ya, yeah, right? Uh -huh. Cuando nos faltan las, las prepositions, demostramos que estamos en un nivel básico. Entonces, uh -huh. nosotros vamos a ir creciendo. Por eso yo necesito decirles, uh -huh. recalcarles todo esto, right? Para que ustedes okay. crezcan, ¿ok? Sí. Prepositions, sí. remember, at. Sí. Con el sí. tiempo, you have to associate. You have to associate time in the preposition sí. at. Okay. Ah, okay, my question oh. is to Ronnie. Can you hear me, Ronnie? Tell me. All right. So let me see. I'm gonna use a different one. Okay. I'm gonna use what? Okay. What do you do on Monday morning? Uh... I put put in at uh, a a.m. Okay. What else? Um. Oh, um, before um, drink coffee. Um, visit um, the office. Uh, uh Oscar. Okay, so you visit, you visit Oscar's office. Visit office. Vamos a ponerlo eso porque eso ya es con un posesivo. I visit. I visit. Oscar's office, right? Yeah. I visit Oscar's office. Oops, my dog is playing around. <laughs> ¿Cómo te dice el eh, pedir un favor? ¿Cómo pedir un favor es ask for a favor? Ask for ask a favor. For a ask a favor. Ask. You ask a favor to to Please. Oscar? Yes. <laughs> Sorry about that. And that happens every Monday. So every Monday, uh, every Monday you need a favor. Todos los lunes necesitas un favor del del Oscar. No. Just just in this Monday. <laughs> Guys, fíjense qué diferencia hay si ustedes solo dicen what do you do? ¿Se acuerdan que la habíamos repasado? Yes. Yes. Si es así, solo hablamos de sus ocupaciones, de sus trabajos. Mm -hmm. Pero la pregunta cambia si yo le, le agrego, como acá en este caso con Ronnie, what do you do, you do in the morning? on the morning. Monday, on Monday morning? ¿Qué estoy morning. haciendo ahí? ¿Qué estoy preguntando? ¿Quiero saber solo una actividad? No. El lunes por la mañana. Quiero saber many activities, all the activities, if possible. Porque, ¿qué haces? Ya no es que haces tú. No, ya es que haces tú el lunes uh, en la mañana. O sea, tu rutina. Routine. Think of routine. Uh, I'll speak with, with Ramon. Mm -hmm. Is my assist. Uh, ¿Cómo se diría? Mm, mi colega o mi auxiliar. Co-worker. 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 
Co-worker. Co uh -huh. co También puedes decir colleague. Colleague. He's my colleague. Repeat. He's my, my assistant. Colleague. He's, <laughs> my, he's my assistant. Okay, puede ser. He's my assistant. He's my coworker. My partner. He's my partner. Okay, cool. Okay. Let me see. I have a question for Oscar. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Go ahead. When does your supervisor visit you? No tiene ley. My supervisor is my boss, so he supervises the, the projects. Um, eh, every, como, como sería cada vez que, que los termino. Each every time. time. Uh, every every time, time when when I finish. Every time I finish. Every time I finish. Uh, okay. Supervise. My boss supervise my. Or supervises. Supervise. Supervise. Third person. My boss supervises. My boss supervises my projects when I finish. Or you can say as soon as. As soon as, okay. Hey, aprendamos esa expresión. As. Tan pronto. Soon. Tan pronto as que. As soon as finishing. ¿Es posible? Con. As Con. soon as possible. Correct. As soon oh. as possible. Aprendamos esa, esa palabra, as soon as possible, es lo antes posible, es como con urgencia. Pero hay, en tu caso sería, as soon as I finish. Mm -hmm. Right? Good. ASAP. ASAP, ¿verdad? Bárbaro. ASAP. ASAP. A ver, guys, aquí Douglas nos comparte ASAP. Repeat, ASAP. ASAP. I need to finish. Repeat, I need to finish. I need project. To finish. finish. I, I, need need to finish. Finish. I need to finish. ASAP. 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 I need to make the report. ASAP. 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 ASAP, ASAP is the le abbreviation, is the abbreviation of as soon, soon as, as possible. Possible. Muy buen vocabulario, Douglas. Me alegra mucho. Bueno, es que hay en Aeromán todo en inglés, ¿verdad? Yes. Yes. Thank you, teacher. I'm glad, I'm glad you're managing technical vocabulary. Yeah, este vocabulario es yeah. técnico, pero no quiero afligir a los demás compañeros. Acuérdense <laughs> que hay muchos que estamos eh, iniciando también. Mm -hmm. Entonces, pues, a veces me gusta también hablarles en español para que vayan con nosotros ahí, ¿verdad? As soon as possible. Lo antes es como al, algo urgente. As soon as possible. I need my money. As soon as possible. I need my dinner. As soon as possible. <laughs> <laughs> Examples like that with urgency, right? Okay, bueno, los dejo a ustedes. Solo lo voy a corregir, right? I'm gonna just monitor you. I'm gonna correct you. Ustedes hacen preguntas. Acuérdense que la idea es usar los WH words. Todas las que vimos ayer, right? We practiced this yesterday. What, when, where, why, which, who. Okay, and we're going to uh, use prepositions. En las respuestas, tratemos de buscar qué preposición uh, se adapta, right? A mi respuesta, to my context. Let's start with Oscar. Can you make a question to the class? Using what? Using any WH word. Okay, any victim? I say, I say any partner. You say it in general. You say it in general. Oh. Él va a tirar la, los dulces, right? Ustedes, quien me agarre la pregunta, porque aquí sí, verdad, no podemos irnos uno por uno. Unos los van a poder atrapar toda, otros van a atrapar un poquito de lo que Oscar diga, y otros no van a atrapar nada. Pero eso sí es, guys, right? Mientras más lo vamos repitiendo, ustedes van a ir aprendiendo, right? Cada quien eh, tiene un poquito eh, de nivel, right? So, entonces, 
quien me tenga la pregunta me participa, right? Los demás no se preocupen si no me entienden, vayan tomando nota, eso sí, eso espero yo que ustedes estén tomando nota de todo. ¿Ok? Let's go, Douglas. General, pues, y si solo tiras la pregunta y ahí, ¿verdad? General. <risa> Douglas o or Oscar. Douglas or Oscar. I'm sorry. <risa> I'm so excited with Douglas today. Ok, I'm sorry. It's Oscar's turn. Ok, next you go with Douglas, maybe. I'm sorry, Oscar. Ok, ok. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm going to ask him something and I hope that you can answer me. Okay? Hopefully. Hopefully. Okay. Um, what time do you what time do you leave your work? Yo así como que suele las mimics, ¿verdad? <laughs> Repeat, please, Oscar. What time do you leave your work? Do you copy, guys? I leave, uh, I I leave a work approx at 4 p.m. Okay, thank you. Let me hear you. Let me hear you again. Can you repeat the answer? What time do you leave? No, the, the answer. The answer. Ah, okay. Do you I leave? Leave at, I leave work at 4 p.m. Okay. Okay, that works. I leave work Teacher. at 4 p.m. Go ahead, Luz. Uh, I leave uh, uh, two hours at night. Um, ¿Cómo le digo? Dos horas de mi trabajo. Acabo de llegar. Oh, okay. Usted acaba de llegar a casa. Sí, eh, sería. Sí, pero esa, esa respuesta no aplica en la pregunta. La ah, pregunta okay. es, ¿a qué horas tú dejas el trabajo? Uh -huh. o te, te retiras de tu trabajo. Sí, 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 uh, manejamos ese verbo, guys. Creo que Susi no. lo dio ayer. Se, I, se, I con, think so. se confunde con leave, con leave o con lead. Eso me pasa. Confunde. Oh, uh -huh. ok, 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 ok. Bueno, ayer lo escribimos de hecho, pero aquí va. Live de vivir es así, ¿verdad? Live. L, L, I, A, V, I. Y lo que pasa es que la pronunciación es la misma. Live uh -huh. and live. Uh -huh. Entonces, ayer yeah. el contexto es lo que define. Entonces, sería el último. Homophones. They are homophones. Right, they are homophones. L, E, A, V, E, live. Repeat, leave. Ajá, yo entendí que a cuánto tiempo estaba mi trabajo. Vivía de mi trabajo. Lo entendí okay. mal. Ok, no problem, no problem. Entonces, what time, what time, what time do, do you, you live? Live. Teacher. Yes, sir. Y cuando, en, cuando por, ejemplo, por ejemplo, estamos, por decir, I am in life. O sea, estoy en vivo, se escribe live, pero no se, no se pronuncian igual. I am live. Ajá, es que ese uh -huh. es como en vivo y en directo. Uh -huh. yes. In live. I am live. I am live. I am live. Uh -huh. live. Like, like, live. A, like a champions soccer match, right? You uh -huh. watch it? Yeah. Live. Live. Yes. I see, Bar I see Barcelona. Like. Oh, really? <laughs> nice, nice. One point extra yeah. for you. Good job. <laughs> Thank you. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Uh, I can say it uh, at uh, five, at uh, five p.m. But but at, but you need to answer. say you need for to the say answer. the complete answer. I. Uh, I. I live. Okay. I, live I am work. live work at wait, wait, five wait. p.m. I, I am live. or I live. I, I, I live. I live. I live. I live. The verb is live. live. I live. I am my work. I live my work. I live my work. Five. At p.m. Five p.m. Very Every well. day. Very I live well. Every day. Every day. Every day. Okay. 
my <laughs> next participant. Who's the next participant? Let me see, Douglas. Aha, uh -huh, Douglas, make a question for the class. Okay. Um, what type do you do you choose use in the work? Bueno, para vestir, ¿cuál era el verbo que vamos a usar en este caso? Wear. 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 ¿Se acuerda Wear. que se pronuncia igual que la palabra donde, verdad? Wear. 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 Ok. Wear. Entonces, Douglas, what, Sería, what type of what, shoes? What type, what type do you wear shoes in the work? Sería, what type of shoes? What type? Do you wear what type of shoes do you at work. wear at work? You wear relaxed today. What I am relaxed today, man. <laughs> I have to wash my clothes. That's why. I wear, I wear I'm sorry. Case, I'm sorry, Ronnie. In my case, I wear the boots. ¿Cómo sería ahí, teacher? Sí, sí, sí. Botas. I wear boots. boots. ¿Se acuerdan de las, de las botas? Boots. B-O-O-T-S. I wear boots. Boots. Entonces, With la correcta. Hey, uh, Douglas, can you repeat the question correctly? I just chatted to you. Mm, ok. What time? What time? Type. What, what, type. what type? What type? Shoes. What type? What type? Shoes. Wait, what type of wear? shoes? Of shoes. Okay. What type of shoes do you wear at work? Do you work at, at work? If the if it is que ahí estamos usando en realidad dos preposiciones of qué tipo de zapatos of y también at, ¿verdad? What type of shoes do you wear at work? Volunteers. At work. The I, type of shoes. I wear flats. Okay. <laughs> you wear your flats, huh, Carla? Very comfy, I, okay? Go. It's a relax. You wear a sneaker. I'm sorry? Can you repeat? I wear, I wear a sneaker. I wear a sneaker, sneakers. only one. No. I wear, I wear sneakers. sneakers. I wear awesome. sneakers. I wear sneakers because it's two, it's two feet, right? Yes. Continue. I, Continue. I, wear, oh. I am wearing flip flats. Oh, that's right now. That's right now. Yes. But usually the question is, is it's in simple present? Okay. What type of shoes do you wear at work? Mm. You wear? I wear sneakers. You wear sneakers? Yes, sneakers. Almost I slippers, wear. huh? Almost I slippers. Wear. I wear sneakers. Wear. <laughs> you wear sneakers? Okay, cool. Nice. I uh -huh. wear boots. I you wear, wear boots, boots. Reina? I wear boots, yes. I wear, I wear boots. I wear boots. Wear, I wear boots. Open your mouth, open your mouth. I wear boots for the projects. Excellent. Where, when I go to the project. Projects, uh-huh, who else? Nobody else? That's a good question. That's a good question, Douglas. Okay, let me choose Josue. Can you make a question for the class? Go. Ya tengan su pregunta ahí. What time do you punch in? Good question. Um, I punch in I punch. 7 a.m. Are you sure? Is that correct? Can you repeat? I punch in at 7 a.m. Ahí está. Solo me corrige a.m. A.m. 
Yes, I punch in at 7 a.m. But congratulations, Douglas. You understood the question very well. Next, who else? What time do you punch in? I punch, I punch in, in at 7 a.m. Five a.m. Yes. You really a morning person. <laughs> I am your fan. I put him. I am your fan. Thank you. What time? What time do you? What time do you wake up? Okay, okay. Look, ahí tenemos un follow-up question de Douglas para Kathleen. What time, what time do, do you, you wake up? If you if you punch in at 5 a.m., what time do you wake up? Uh huh. What time do you wake up, Kathleen? I wake up at 5. No. No. No, niña, ¿cómo va a creer? <laughs> si las mujeres se tardan. <laughs> ¿Verdad? Uh, uh -huh. Pero no es levantarse, wake up. Wake yeah. up es despertar. <laughs> you open your eyes. Es que si dice que, que marca a las 5 a.m., ¿a qué hora se despierta? Correcto. Entendí mal, entonces, eh, porque <risa> llego al trabajo a las 6, punch in. Ah, Entendí. ok, ok, qué bueno aclarar punch eso. In. Entonces, Ajá. punch Ay. in, ¿qué era punch in? Marcar. Marcar, marcar, marcar la, entrada. la hora de marcar. entrada. Entrada. Ajá, entrada. Ajá, por eso es que, to, por eso es que nos, impact, nos impactaste a todos, todos así como que. Una wow, hora, no, no, Y yo me quedo. Diferencia. Wow, yo soy tu fan. Mm -hmm. <ríe> y entonces, ¿cómo sería, Kathleen? What time do you punch in? I, I punch in at 6 a.m. 6 a.m. Ok, so you get up at 5 a.m. You, you wake yes. up. Ok, ok. That makes sense. Repeat, guys. Sure. That makes sense. Repeat. Sure. That makes sense. That makes sense. Eso tiene sentido. That makes sense. Repeat, guys. That makes sense. 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 Sense. Tiene sentido. A ver, dime, Ronnie, go ahead. I, I, I have a question. Oh, please. Go. What, what do you like best about your job? Okay, that's a solid question. What do you like best about your job? I think that is a very advanced question for this uh, class. Uh huh. Somebody? What do I you like, like I best? Like, uh, I, like my, I like my work, but I work with aircraft. Mm -hmm. No. I mean, I understand you, I understand you, pero no estás satisfaciendo la pregunta. What, 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 what's you, the, what's the, the, the question? Okay, uh, okay, what, okay. What Repeat the, the question, question slow, slow. Okay. Ronnie? What do you like? What do you? What do you like? Don't forget the auxiliaries. Like? What do you like? Like. What do you? Like, uh -huh. like, what do you like? Best, uh -huh. best, best. Repeat, Ronnie. Best. What do you like best? Repeat, Ronnie. Uh, what do you like uh, best? What do you like? What do you like about your job? Best. About my, about my job. Ronnie, Ronnie, I Ronnie. Like. Your, 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 your. Can you repeat the question one more time for the class, please? What, what do, you do you like, like best, best about your about job? Your love. About your love like or your okay. job? <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. Mm. The, the best, there, there is nothing. The best there is like nothing. 
I work because I work with aircraft. That makes sense. Repeat, guys. That, that makes, sense. makes sense. Okay. That makes sense. Do you understand, Douglas? You see the difference? Yes. Absolutely. Uh huh. That's right. Okay. I like best. I like best. I like best. Lo que más like me best. gusta. Best. Turn on the PC. <laughs> <laughs> to turn on the PC. Okay. Turn You're on the PC. In Photoshop. Oh, yeah, because you like working like that. Huh? What? It says, Jose tiene una. Dice, Jose, who do you have dinner with at home? Okay. So, quiero ver... No necesariamente, let me see. Who do you have dinner with? Me le pusiste, bueno, uh, sin H, doble H y with, let me see, okay. with. Like this. Eh, thank you so much. Okay, who do you have dinner with? Who do you have dinner with? Go. I have a dinner with my wife. Good okay. for you, good for you. Thank you. Somebody else? Correct, Douglas. Who do you have dinner with? Uh -huh. I often take my, my dinner alone because my wife and my child take dinner more earlier. More you say, earlier, you say yeah. earlier. Okay, earlier. Yeah, I think it, it's important more, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice, yeah, nice. Mm -hmm. So you have dinner apart yeah because i i take dinner when i finish the class mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so do i mm -hmm. thank you for the question sir let me see victor what's your question for the class hi hey victor tiene do you have a question yes who do you like with? With. Bueno, ya, ya hicimos con with bastante. Mm -hmm. Quiero que me usen. Quiero ver. When do you start work? Ahí sí. Ahí sí. Ya no vamos a usar what time, ni ya no vamos a usar este who. Usemos las demás, ok. A ver, Víctor, repeat. When. Why, why does she wake, wake? Oops. No, antes de esa dijo otra. When do you start work? When do I you start, start work? I start, I start work at 7 a.m. AM. Very well, very well. Thank I you, Douglas. Start, I start work at 8.05. 8 8.05? Okay. Somebody else? I start work at 7 a.m. 7 a.m. Remember, you can say 7 a.m. or 7 in the morning. The morning. The yes. Morning. Thank you. Somebody else? Try, try to speak, guys. Ya lo, ya lo escuchamos tres veces. Tres compañeros dijeron ya. Entonces, ya su oído, right? You have to have an idea. When do you start work? A ver ese audio, please. Please, please, please. Se entiende que en el centro de sal de Lero va a ser la recepción a las 3 de la tarde y que no va a haber misa. ¿Quién verá la misa? Yo no voy a ir. No vamos a ir porque no va a haber. <risa> ok. Estamos en la clase, no podemos ir. <risa> ok. So, when do you start work? I start work at eight o'clock on the morning. On the morning? On the morning. In, in, in the, the morning. morning. In the morning. In, in, in. in the morning. I have a question for the class. When do you celebrate Mother's Day? I celebrate Mother's Day uh, on... Okay. On May. May. On May. May. Uh, 10. 
Yes. Repeat, guys. I celebrate, I celebrate. I celebrate. Mother's I Day. Celebrate. Mother's Day. Day. Mother's 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 Day. What month is your birthday in? Repeat what? the question. Can you repeat what again? Month? My, what month? My oh. birthday what, uh, is. My birthday is on February. It's in, in December. It's in December. My birthday, my birthday is on February. My birthday is on July. Sorry. Okay, that is correct. Pero si solo decíamos el mes. In, um, in July. In July. In August. In October. In February. In February. In September. In September. Ahora si damos toda la fecha, is on. Very well. Si aprendimos a decir cuando, cuando nacimos. I was born on... ¿Verdad que sí lo vi con ustedes? Yo me acuerdo. Yes, 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 yes. yes. I was, I was que born. salió de repente, oh. when were you born? When were you born? Aunque aquí ya, lo, ya nos estamos adelantando un poquito ya con el pasado, guys, pero eh, quisiera que usáramos lo de los años. When were you born? When. 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 When? Or what year? Yeah. Um, um, December 17, 19, 1988. 1988. De dos en dos, ¿verdad? 1988. 1990. 1995. 1999. Como nos dijo que no tenemos que agregarle el in al final, sino que That's totally, totally right. Okay. Bueno, let me see. Let me stop sharing this one. Let me stop sharing this one. Y creo que en la otra presentación tenemos algo más. Okay. Let me see. Right here. Hey, good practice, guys. Practice. Ustedes sí que van bien afilados for the next module. You're going sharp. Afilados. You're going very sharp. Well, there are many exceptions and rules to follow. In general, we can follow these two simple rules. For yes and no questions, there will be a rising intonation. For example, is she getting up? Are they sleeping? For WH questions, there will be a falling intonation. For example, what's she doing? What are they doing? This topic, along with all the other pronunciation topics, require careful listening and to practice. I would like for you to listen carefully to your favorite English. Okay. Let's move on. Favorite. Favorite. Mm -hmm. Favorite. Okay, let's see. Okay, vamos a repasar present continuous. Let me see. Present continuous. Present continuous. Here. W -H Okay, give me one sec. Okay, so it's kind of stuck. Okay, 
Bueno, se trabó eso. Vamos a aprovechar para pasar la asistencia la segunda vez. Before I forget, I know it's early, but let's do it, guys. Douglas Humberto Sánchez Díaz, are you still with us? I am here, teacher. All right, Hugo Ezequiel Deras Mauricio. Present. All right, it is Yvette Saldaña Leonard Lucy. Iván Armando Méndez Parada. Present. Jose Heriberto Cruz Amaya. I'm here. Oh my goodness, sir. And let me see. Okay, so. uh, Jose Valmore Cruz Montano. I'm here. Juan Ramón Navarro Díaz. Testing. Catalina Stephanie Portillo de Lorenzana. Present teacher. Okay. Lucia del Carmen Ayala Mejía. Present teacher. Luz Marlene Cornejo Álvarez. Present teacher. Melvin Rafael Díaz Mijango. Present. Noel Ernesto Vega Ortiz. Present. Oscar Armando Flores Rodríguez. And here teacher. Roberto Antonio Ramírez González. Oh, Roberto is absent. Ronnie Osvaldo Claros Flamenco. Present. Susana Carolina Alfaro Gómez. Oh, Sus is absent today. Victor Manuel Andrade Galeas. I am here. Jocelyn Lisbeth Angel Inglés. Present. Thank you. Carlos Eduardo Gómez Gómez. We have Reina Mercedes Altagracia Barrientos. Present teacher. Carla Lisette Valladares Flamenco. Present teacher. And Jeanette Esmeray Guzman Rosa. All right. All right. Thank you guys for your attendance. Let me see if this one is this one is working now. Let me check. Okay. I think it's working. So we understand about rising and falling intonation. Right, I'm going to practice now present continuous, present continuous, repeat, present continuous. Yes. Present, present continuous. continuous. Present continuous. Progressive. Correct. Present progressive. Present progressive. Es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Pueden decir progressive or continuous. Anyways, es ahí donde usamos el gerund. Right? So let me just share this now. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn to ask and answer present continuous questions. Additionally, we will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation between a boy and his mother, which illustrates WH questions in context. Let's listen and practice. <laughs> Hi, Mom. What are you no. doing, Steve? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now, let's try to make sense of present... Two o'clock in the okay, morning. Okay, let's repeat. Can you see the conversation? Are you able to see it? Can you... Can you... Can you read it? Yes. We have a conversation with the, with the between Steve and his mother. Okay. Let's suppose you guys are going to be Steve and I'm going to role play Steve's mom. You ready? You start. Three, two, one. Let's go. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. What are you doing, doing Steve? Steve? What are you doing, Steve? I am cooking. What are you, cooking, are you cooking now? now? No. It's two o'clock in, in the morning. In the morning. Well, 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 I am really hungry. Really hungry. I am what are you what making? Are you making? Pizza. Pizza. Mm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. 
Okay, do you have any question on this conversation? Any unfamiliar word? Any question, any doubt? Well, any comment? <laughs> no? Do you have no comment about the conversation? Um, hungry is hambriento. Correct, hungry. Hambriento. H U N G R Y. Repeat hungry. Sleeping? Hungry. Repeat hungry. Repeat I hungry. am hungry. hungry. I am hungry. 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 Okay, don't confuse it with angry, right? Mm -hmm. Angry is different. Angry. Yes? Angry. Es, es molesto, correct. Y hambriento. Mm -hmm. Hungry. 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 Okay. Okay. What else? The word really. Repeat. Really. 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 Really tiene diferentes usos, guys. Puede, puede que es para really. algo como interesante, como really, como que no te creo, ¿verdad? Really, como que está interesante la información. Um, ¿Qué más? Uh, ¿En este caso? It's two o'clock in the morning. En este caso, aplica usar really hungry. Si usted dice, I am hungry, diga. I am, I am hungry. I am hungry. I am hungry. I am hungry. Oh, estoy hambriento. Repeat, I am hungry. I am hungry. I am hungry. I am hungry. Pero si usted dice, I am really hungry. Realmente. I am really hungry. No exagera. Muy hambriento. Correcto. Tengo mucha hambre. Modifica, ¿verdad? Ese really se convierte en un adverbio. Si va antes de un adjetivo, se convierte en un adverb. ¿Qué está modificando ahí, verdad? Um, hungry. Really hungry. Really hungry. Really hungry. ¿Y por qué? Uh, si, si analizan el contexto, la mamá, ¿verdad? Como que extrañada. What are you cooking? Repeat. What, why are you cooking now? Why are you cooking now? ¿Pero por qué? Piden la explicación. Why? Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I am. I am not hungry. I am really hungry. I am really hungry. You see? You see? Yeah. Okay. Good. I am good. Really hungry. Hey. Let's continue. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's making? eat. Now let's try to make sense of present continuous WH questions. What are you making? Can you identify? Can you identify? Present continuous. Yes, I am cooking. I cooking. am cooking. Making. Uh, I initially. Are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you doing? Hey, what different are you doing? what do you do? What are you making? What are you making? What are you doing? Yes. ¿Qué estás haciendo? I am getting. I am getting. I am getting. I am getting hungry. Hungry. How do we interpret this verb getting in this case? I am getting hungry. Um, getting? I'm getting hungry. 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 Me está dando hambre porque I'm getting. Porque usted dice, I'm hungry. Tengo hambre. Ajá. I am really hungry. Estoy hambriento. I am, I am getting hungry. Me está dando hambre. It's like a little. Uh -huh. All right. Nice job. Let's continue. Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. 
Si, si tratamos de usar intonation, ¿se acuerdan? Rising intonation and falling intonation. A ver, en la primera pregunta, ¿cómo sería? Hi, mom. Hi, mom. What are you doing? Hi, mom. What are you doing? What are you doing? ¿Quién es? Reinita, me va a poner el mute, por favor, mute, porque su, su mascota está ahí, ¿verdad? Activa. No es el mío. No es. Oh, no es ahora el suyo. Ok. Entonces sería, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, what are you doing Steve? What are Repeat. You doing? What are you doing, Steve? Ahora, ¿qué estás haciendo? Ya es otra pregunta, ¿verdad? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Ya no es que haces. What do you do? Or what do you do on Monday mornings? Ahora es, what are you doing? What are you doing, Steve? ¿Qué acción estás haciendo? ¿Qué estás haciendo? I'm cooking. For example, you, what are you doing right now? I, I, I am studying. I am studying. I am studying. I am studying. With I'm ING, studying. I am studying I am English. Studying. I, am I am sitting. I am sitting. Yes. I am practicing. I am English. practicing. I am. I am in my class. I am. I am ING, I am talking. Talking. I am, I am talking. talking. I am speaking in English. Speaking English. I am learning. I am, I am learning. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. I am improving. <laughs> Estoy mejorando. Improving. I am improving. <clears throat> you guys are... No, no. Mejorando. Improving mejorando. is mejorar. Pongámoselo aquí a Vic. <laughs> no está en la lista, creo yo, porque ese es... Um, I am B... <laughs> This is regular. Uh -huh. oh. Okay. Two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now, let's try to make sense of present continuous. The okay, look at this. We have some information there, okay? For example, for example, the first picture. What city is this? Sleeping. Where is she? Where is she? She is sleeping. Where? Where is she? In the bed. She is. She is in her bed. In her bed. She is in Los she's Angeles. Los Angeles. Wow. Angeles. Okay. Ah. What time is in Los Angeles? At 4 a.m. It's, it's 4 a.m. 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 Or? Or it's four, four, four in the morning. 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 Repeat. What's Victoria doing? What's Repeat. What's, what's Victoria? What's Victoria doing? Doing. Victoria doing. Victoria doing. What's Victoria doing? Victoria doing. Victoria doing. Victoria doing. Repeat. What's Victoria doing? What's Victoria doing? Guys, what's Victoria doing right now? She's sleeping right now. She's sleeping right now. She's sleeping right now. Just like my father next door, he's sleeping right now. <laughs> okay, the next picture. What's his name? What's his name? His name is Marcos. Excellent, Carla. Repeat. His name is Marco. His name, His name is Marco. His name is Marco. What city is Marco in? What city in is Marco city. in? Mexico City. Mexico, 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 Mexico City. City. What time is it in Mexico? 6 a.m. 6 a.m. 6 a.m. Repeat, Victor. It's 6 a.m. Excelente. Oh. It's six o'clock in the, in the morning. morning. What's Marcos doing, class? What's Marcos doing? 
It's Ahí estamos la, usando el conjunction so. Repeat. It's so. 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 Para dar un resultado. Así que, por lo tanto, de tal manera. Repeat. It's 6 a.m. It's, it's 6 a.m. Yeah. Yeah. De acuerdo al so. tiempo, ¿verdad? According to the time, it's 6 a.m. So. 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 Getting up. Getting up. He's getting up. It's 6 a.m. So he's getting up. Listen. Listen. It's getting up. Please listen. Yes. It's 6 a.m. So he is getting up. Repeat. So, so, así que, temen ahí un tiempito. So, 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 he's getting up. He's getting up. Vamos a ver, ¿cómo interpretamos eso? How do you interpret that? Son las 6 a.m. Son las 6 a.m. Entonces, él se está levantando. Está levantando. Por lo, tanto, está por lo tanto, por lógica, ¿verdad? Porque es temprano. Así es. Thank you. Let's go with the next one. Where are they? What city are they? What city are they? New York City. They are. They are. They are in. They are. In New York City. We don't know. We don't know if they are from mm -hmm. New York City, but what we do know, though, is that they are in New they, York City. And are. what time is it in they New are. York City? It's 7. It's 7 o'clock. 7 a.m. In, in the evening. Seven. It's 7 in the morning. Seven. 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 In the morning. Ah, in the morning. morning. I'm sorry. Okay, it's 7 in the morning. Repeat, it's 7 in the morning. 7 in the morning. It's 7 a.m. What are, what are Sue and Tom doing? They, they are having breakfast. They are having breakfast. In this moment. Eso es lo que significa. Right now. In this moment. Yes. Right now. WH questions. Let's check. We will typically use present continuous WH questions whenever we want to get information from an action that is in progress. For example, what are you doing right now? To form WH questions, we need to follow this formula. WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus the verb plus ing plus some kind of complement. If we look at the images on the screen, you can see a few WH questions. Let's analyze the first one. What's Victoria doing? We have a WH word, what. Then we have the verb to be, is. After that, we have the subject. Victoria. After that, we have the uh, verb in its ing form. And then we have a question mark. Then, of course, you can see the question being answered. She's sleeping now. Now, we're going to listen to the rest of the questions and answers. Let's listen and repeat. Los Angeles, 4 a.m. What's Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. Mexico City, 6 a.m. What's Marcos doing? It's 6 a.m., so he's getting up. New York City, 7 a.m. What are Sue and Tom doing? They're having breakfast. Brasilia, 9 a.m. Brasilia, repeat, 9 a.m. Brasilia. What's Celia doing? What's Celia doing? 
She's going to work. She's going. Going. She's going. She's going to work. She's going to work right now. It's this is happening right now. Yes. Yes. What's Celia doing? She's going to work. London, twelve what, noon. What time is it in London? What are James and Anne doing? What What time is it in London? Twelve Sorry. Twelve at noon. Twelve at noon. Twelve at noon. What are James and Anne doing? Uh, it's noon. They are having lunch. So they are having lunch. Having it's lunch. noon, so they're having lunch. Moscow, 3 p.m. What's Andre doing? He's working. Repeat, what's Andre doing? What's Andre, what's Andre, Andre doing? doing? What's Andre Repeat, doing? he's working. What's Andre. Working. Working. He's working. working. And what time is it? What time is it in Moscow? It's 3 p.m. Or it's 3 in the afternoon. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. Nice in job. Next. Bangkok, 7 p.m. What's Permsak doing? He's eating dinner right now. Okay, Bangkok. What time is it in Bangkok? Bangkok. What time is it? 7 a.m. It's 7 p.m. It's 7 p.m. Or it's 7? At night. No. Evening. In the evening. In the evening. In the evening. Repeat, evening. in the evening. In the evening. It's seven in the evening. Correct. So what is he doing? What is he doing? He's, he's eating. He's dinner eating right dinner. dinner. Yes. Dinner right now. Eating dinner right now. Dinner Repeat. Right now. Right now. Right, right, now. Now. right, right now. now. Right, right now. now. Tokyo, 9 p.m. What's Hiroshi 9 doing? Yes. Tokyo. What time is it in Tokyo? 9 p.m. It's 9, 9, 9 p.m. It's 9 in the morning. Or in the morning? No. Yeah, uh, no, 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 no. At night. Or at night. At night. Or at night. night. 9 p.m. 9 in the evening. 9 p.m. Okay. At night. What's he doing? What's he doing? He's watching television. He's watching, te He's watching, watching TV. television. He's watching television. He's watching TV. Okay, can you tell me what are your family members doing? What are you and your family members doing? Hugo, what are you doing right now? My mother is uh, watching TV. Okay, right and now. you, what are you doing? I am studying you? English. Fantastic. Volunteers? My mother is sleeping right now. Oh, yeah, Victor, your mother is sleeping right now? Yes. What about your brother, sister, your best friend? No, not. not uh, what are they I doing? Know. What are they doing? I don't. I doing. It's, it's, okay, it's studying English. I am studying English. I studying English. I am studying English right now. What are you I doing? Am. And what is your family member doing? Volunteer? Um, me, I am teaching English right now. And my dad, he's next door. He's sleeping right now. Yes? Continue, guys. Who's next? Talk to me. Talk to me. I am studying English. And my husband watching TV. And my husband is? And my, and my husband is watching TV. Como ahí dependemos del verbo to be. Para el I está bien. I am. I am. Right? Having a class. And my husband is watching TV. Si fuera plural. And the children. 
los hijos. Eh, the children is or the children are? Are. Are. All right. And the children are playing soccer. Yeah. So, yes. ahí, cuidado, la fórmula, right? The bird to be y el gerundio. Thank you, Kathleen. Good job. Somebody else, what are you and your family member doing? Somebody else? In the next door, my wife and son uh, are getting to bed. Okay, they are getting to bed. So they are in the process to yeah. get some sleep. And what about you? What are you doing, Douglas? What are you doing right now? Uh, right, right now, I am studying English and practicing. Fantastic. What about you guys? What are you doing now? What is your family member doing right now, volunteers? I am studying English. Um, my husband um, is asleep in the hammock. Sleeping. Sleeping in the hammock. In the hammock. <laughs> okay, I think I think my brother is studying right now, and my sister is babysitting. ¿Sabes cuál es ese verbo, guys? Babysitting. Babysitting. Viene de baby. Es como cuidar, es como niñera. Niñera. Cuidando bebé, es correcto. Babysitter. Cuidando un baby, se dice babysitting. Baby babysitting. Baby yes, sitting. my sister is babysitting right now because she has a she has a baby. All right. Who else? Who else? What are you doing? What is your best friend doing? Go. Right now, I am studying English. Very well. Um, I am studying. My mother-in-law and my two sons. They are, they are, they are sleeping. They are sleeping already. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. My wife is cooking right now. Nice, nice. What is she cooking? Is she cooking pizza? She's cooking. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Fried fish. Está. Se me olvida. Se me pegó son tortillas con quesillo, ¿no? I don't know how Chila you say that. Chila 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 Chila. No, he's not Chila Salvadorian Chila. food. Chila. Salvadorian typical food called chilaquilas, right? <laughs> Thank you, guys. Awesome, awesome. Hello. My little dog is sleeping right now. Yeah. También podemos hablar de animales, right? Animals, pets, etc. Right? Any questions? So far, so good. What do you say, Hugo? Hugo, did you did you say something? No. No, only okay. it's a my roster. Your roster. <laughs> All right. That <laughs> one. That's good, man. Company. It's a good company. Roster. Okay, let's go ahead and move on. Okay. We have some activities here, okay? Listen and practice. Play tennis. Repeat, play tennis. Play tennis. Play tennis. Play tennis. Play tennis. What is the gerund? Playing. 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 For example, what's he doing? He's playing tennis. He's playing. He's playing, he's playing, 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 playing tennis, tennis right now. He's playing tennis. Repeat, ride a bike. Ride, ride, ride a bike. Ride. 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 Drive. 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 A motorcycle? Ride. 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 Ride a bike. You're riding a bike. A bike. Ride a bike. Ride a bike. La base primero. La base primero, Vic. Kiss. Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Puede también con motorcycle, claro que sí. Ride a bike. Ride a horse. Ride a horse. Espérame, espérame. Víctor, ¿cómo se dice, Víctor? Ride. Oh, ok, ok, ok. No quiero que lo confundan con el verbo 
drive. Drive. Oh. ¿Qué drive es para qué? Car. Car. Para vehículos. Car. Drive. Car. With drive. D. Drive. Yes, drive. 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 Pero solo ride. 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 Bike. Ride. A bicycle. Ride. Ride. A horse. Ride. A camel. Ride. An elephant. T-shirt. In the India? Para... In India? T-shirt. Yes. For a skateboard? For skateboards? Uh huh. For skateboard? I, I ride skateboard or what? How? No, I skateboard. I skateboard. Okay. That's the thing. Ah, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Repeat. Hey, what is the what is the gerund? Ride a bike. What is the gerund? Riding. 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 A bike. For example, what's what's he doing right now? It's I think it's a he. No, it's a she. What's she? She. She 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 is she's riding a bike. Okay. Riding a bike. Run. Repeat, run. 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 What is the gerund? Running. 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 Any special okay. comment? Running. Any Running. special rule? He's running. He's he's running. M-M-I-N-G. Correcto. ¿Por qué? Double M. M. C. B. C. C. Consonant. Vowel CBC consonant. consonant. We duplicate duplicate the last consonant, the consonant. The last and, consonant. and add and ing. Add ing. And running. Por eso es que running les queda con la doble n, ¿verdad? Double n. Running. running. No Ronnie, ¿verdad? No Ronnie, sino que running. 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 Ya están molestando ahí el muchacho. Running. Yeah, running. running. <laughs> ¿Cómo sería Ronnie está corriendo? Ronnie is running right now. Ronnie is okay. running right now. Swim. Repeat. Swim. 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 Lips. Swim. Close. Swim. 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 What is the gerund? Swimming. 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 Anything special? Swimming. Yes. Um, yes. In, duplicate. In, I, in. We duplicate the M. M. Cumple la CBC rule. Complies the CBC rule. Lucy, ya no la vi, Lucy. ¿Qué se hizo? Oh, my goodness. Se miraba como en una de esas películas, mis scary movies. <laughs> Frozen ahí. Okay. I can see you, teacher. Take a walk. Repeat. Take, take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. No tengo que eh, la i es es silent. The take y y the l of walk is silent. No se pronuncia entonces. Take, take a walk. A walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. A walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. Take, take a walk. Take, take, take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. 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 Like the restaurant, the, the Chinese restaurant, right? Take a walk. Take a walk. What is the gerund? A walk. Taking a walk. Taking a walk. So how would you say? How would you say in English? Yo estoy tomando una caminata. I. Taking a walk. I am taking a walk. I am taking a walk. Ese sería un presente continuo. Yo estoy tomando una caminata en este momento. Right? Right now. Dance. Repeat. Dance. 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 What is the gerund? Dancing. Dancing. Question. What are they doing? What are they doing? They are. They are. They are. They are. They are. They are. They are dancing. They are dancing. They are dancing. dance, sino dance. Repeat, dance. They are dancing. 
they are dancing. Let's see. Okay, next. Drive. Ahí sí, con D. Drive. 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 She is driving. She is driving a car right now. Go to the movies. Go to the movies. I, I, I really like this one. Go to the movies. We want to see movies or we want to see cinema. Go to the cinema. Go to the movies. What is the gerund? Going. 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 Ah, yo Going estoy yendo a las películas. How do you say that? I am. To the movies right now. Ooh. Right. A divertirme, no. ¿verdad? I'm going to the movies right <laughs> now. Shop. Repeat. Shop. 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 What is the gerund? Shopping. 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 Double P. Double P. Double P because the CVC rule. My goodness, my students are so intelligent. Shopping. 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 Read. Repeat. Read. 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 She's, she's reading. reading. She's reading. Sorry. Reading, 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 reading a book. The book. A book. Can you repeat? A What's book. she doing? She's reading a book. She's reading a book. A book. Okay. She's reading a book. Study. Repeat. Study. 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 Repeat. Study. 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 Repeat. Study. 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 A ver, Lucía. Study. 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 Solo Study. Lucía. Study. 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 A ver, Hugo. Study. Study. A ver, Study. Josh. Study. Study. ¿Otra vez? Study. 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 Ok. Cuidado con agregar un sonido adicional. Ok, Josh. Calculamos ahí tu pronunciación. No decimos e study porque no lleva study. e, solo el sonido study. s. Study. Study. Pulamos ahí. Study. Study. I study. 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 Yo estudio. Study. I study. I study. I study. Para hablar de una study. rutina. I study English at I study English Corporativo. Yes. Para hablar yes. de lo que estoy haciendo. I am studying I am English. 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 I am right English. Si se entiende esa diferencia, estamos. Yes. Awesome. Uh, watch television. Watch television. Watch television. Television. What is the abbreviation for television? TV. 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 What is the gerund? Watching. Watching. Repeat. Repeat. Watching. 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 No, pero guys, que buena pronunciación Watching. tienen, o sea, Watching. no me dan espacio ni para corregirlos. Watching. Okay. Question, question. What's he doing? She is playing tennis. Okay. He is, no, he is. Es, es que sorry. no se ve bien, en realidad no se ve bien. Vaya. Aquí sí ve. What's she doing? She is studying. She is studying. What's he doing? He's shopping. He's shopping. He is 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 shopping. Plural. What are they doing? 
They're dancing. What's she doing? What's grandma doing? Grandmother taking a walk. She's taking a walk. She's taking a walk. Taking a walk. What's he doing? He's swimming. He's swimming. He's swimming. 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 What are they doing? What are they swimming. doing? They, they are going, 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 going to the movies. Wow. Going to the movies. They are going to the movies. You guys sound yeah. so amazing. They are going to the movies. But ahora ustedes hacen las preguntas. Vamos a ver. Pregunta acá. ¿Cómo sería pregunta acá? What? 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 What's, What's she doing? What's she doing? Okay, she's running. She's running. Okay, what is the question here? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? Okay, he's watching television. Plural question, plural question. What's what they are doing? What they are doing? What they are doing? What? Are, plural. are they? Are they? Are what they? Are, repeat, Lucy. What are, what they, are doing? they? Correct. What, what are, are they doing? doing? What are they what doing? Are are they doing? doing? They are they are they dancing. Dancing. Question here. Question. What are, what they, are, they, are they doing? doing? What are, are they, they doing? going to the movies? They are going to the movies. What wow, guys. They doing? Fantastic. Bueno, a ver, Miss Lucy, ¿qué hemos aprendido este día, Miss Lucy? ¿Cómo se ha sentido en esta jornada tan demandante que hemos tenido? ¿Mm? Creo que estoy aprendiendo un poquito, pero... ¿Cree usted? <risa> no me siento tan, tan, tan capaz. <risa> ¿Siente usted que anda en la luna? Un poco. Ay, cómo es de modesta, Miss. <risa> Vamos a ver. La verdad, pero sí estoy tratando, teacher. Good job, Miss. Good job. Vamos a ver, Hugo. ¿Cómo te sientes, Hugo? ¿Has aprendido este día? Oh, uh, ¿Qué se lleva digo, este día usted, caballero? Repaso del ING. Frase en continuo. Sí, señor. Eh, so, el repaso de las. De, no, WH. Esas preguntas, ¿verdad? Que tanto cuestan. Hey, hicimos un pequeño drill eh, de cómo sería la práctica para el viernes. Obviamente ya para el viernes ya nos va a salir más fluido. First God. Vamos a ver ahí quién más, Miss Luz. ¿Qué hemos ah, aprendido bien. ahora, Miss Luz? ¿Cómo se ha sentido, Miss Marlene? Me falla bastante el internet. Y a veces me pierdo y cuando me está hablando. Y entonces he eh, pensado y la otra semana ya a, a otra, la otro, a otra casa. Porque en mi casa no tengo inter con el teléfono y le paso a la computadora. Pero he aprendido mucho el oído. El oído yo siento que, que ya entiendo un poquito, pero hablarlo me cuesta, ¿verdad? pero entiendo más. Porque como nos ayuda en español usted, se me van quedando y esto lleva a tomar notas. Excelente. Ya me siento. Más? Ya se siente más, más Ay, capaz, más, sí. más animada. Sí, es que sí he estado bastante, bastante alejada. Y, y la sí. verdad es que me cuesta mucho porque acabo de, o sea, vengo a las 7 del trabajo, a 7 y media. Uh -huh. Y ahorita no he descansado ni un rato desde la mañana. Bueno, la otra semana su servidor comienza la U de nuevo. Así no. que me va a tocar correr como dos o tres días ahí. Algún otro día me va a tocar conectarme en otro lugar porque así toca, ¿verdad? Ustedes pues vayan viendo la forma en cómo pueden mejorar eh, toda la, la recepción de la clase. ¿Verdad? Los que tienen problemas de audio, ayúdennos, por favor, con eso. Yo espero que, bueno, si en el caso seguimos juntos, 
podamos mejorar eso y si no pues con el otro teacher que ustedes tengan créanme lo que es súper necesario como grupo que manejemos eso de una mejor manera ustedes tienen que ser capaces de jugar con el botón del mute ¿Verdad? Identificar cuando usted tiene interferencia ahí que va pasando la del pan, pues usted tiene que poner ahí, ¿verdad? El, el mute, el, el micrófono, y así para evitar incidentes. Esas cosas, eh, lo del internet, varios de nosotros tenemos problemas de internet, yo lo entiendo, uh, pero no podemos estar todos los módulos así, porque entonces usted no va a tener el aprovechamiento ideal de este curso. Eh, si usted está teniendo problemas de internet, eh, yo lo entiendo ahora, pero el día de mañana trate de mejorar en eso por su bien, por su futuro, porque lo ideal es que usted aprenda y desarrolle todas las habilidades, no solo el entendimiento, ¿verdad? sino también la participación. A través de la participación, usted va hablando. Yo quiero felicitarlos por la participación que ustedes tienen. Es intachable. Y ustedes vienen de trabajar, muchos están cansaditos, muchos casi me comen con, con el abostezo, pero, pero yo sé que ustedes están, están haciendo un esfuerzo, guys, y yo los admiro bastante por eso, y yo por eso me entrego con ustedes. Yo sé que ustedes algo van reteniendo, I know for a fact. Yo sé que estoy como que sembrando una semilla en ustedes. So keep it up, no le vamos a quitar más tiempo, guys. Good night. Ajá. Uh -huh. I need a favor. <ríe> eh, ¿Usted tiene algún link de audios como para escuchar conversaciones y uh, estar escuchando un poquito más? Porque yo tengo mucho, mucho problema con entender las preguntas. Para escuchar A leerlas las puedo entender más fácil, mucho más fácil. Pero al escucharlas se me hace... Quiere escuchar más, más listenings, como tener más ejercicios de listenings por, para Exacto. usted practicar. Sí. Me parece, mis, déjeme entonces le busco algo por ahí que sea interesante, útil para usted, para su nivel, y pronto estaré respondiéndole. Ok, guys, have yes. a good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. I'm happy for you. you good night. Tomorrow. Get some sleep. ¿Quién se quedaba conmigo? ¿Quién se quedaba? Good night, good night everyone. Bye. Bye. Who? Hugo? ¿Quién Joe. se quedaba? Víctor. Yo. Oh, ok, sí. Víctor. I'm sorry. You voy a despedirme. Ok, Víctor, stay good night, people. See you tomorrow. Víctor Manuel Andrade Galias, this is your coaching session. Man, qué gusto tenerlo por acá, Víctor. Igualmente, gusto tener el coach. Dígame, ¿cómo estamos? ¿Cómo va su proceso de aprendizaje? ¿Cómo va su proceso de aprendizaje de inglés? ¿Cómo hace su comparación eh, dentro de este Víctor que usted tiene ahorita al Víctor que inició el primer día en este módulo? ¿Habrá un, una diferencia ahí? Sí, la verdad es que sí he aprendido y he tratado de, de agarrar lo más que puedo. Es primera vez que me inscribo a un, a un curso de inglés. Entonces, sí, estoy dentro del grupo que le está costando un poco más, ¿verdad? Porque eh, se parte que es un nivel básico, básico. Pero eh, tenemos que tener ya como un um, vocabulario. Un poco, porque he visto a varias personas, por ejemplo, Oscar, eh, Hugo, ya tienen algo de vocabulario, eh, Susana. Eh, y hay varios que también tenemos bien poco vocabulario y eso nos dificulta porque nos quedamos a veces en la luna cuando están hablando, ¿verdad? O cuando hace una pregunta. Trato de, de tomar nota y de ver los videos que manda. Siempre los veo después de, de clase. Los videos, todos los links que manda, siempre los veo, los escucho. Excelente. Y, y la verdad es que sí se ha aprendido un poco. Pero lo que, lo que me dificulta a mí es que como no, no tengo mucho vocabulario, yo tengo que ampliarme más en cuanto a vocabulario. Y si se ha fijado, yo me he quedado a veces en el coach de otra... De, de infiltrado ahí, escuchando la, los tips que le ha dado a otras personas. ¡Es cierto! ¡Es cierto! Lo hacías a propósito, lo sabía. No, sí, pero más que todo, más que por estar oyendo lo que hablan, sino que los tips, por ejemplo, lo de los verbos, que es algo bien fundamental, es como que si quiero avanzar, tengo que aprenderme muchos verbos, porque allá donde... Y en los cinco queda, tiempos, así. Víctor. Sí, en los en cinco, los cinco tiempos. tiempos, vaya, por, ahorita nosotros, por ejemplo, ya, ya dominamos los tres. Presente es el simple, presente, tercera simple, persona y, y progresivo. Y continuo, progresivo. 
gente, ahorita estás así, entonces adicionalmente ir la mía extra es que tú te aprendas el pasado simple y el pasado participio. Por lo menos un verbo así diario, eh, todos estos verbos básicos, todos estos que acabamos de ver, take, swim, run, ride, play, drive, go, shop, read, study, watch, mm -hmm. todos esos son verbos básicos que, su, que se usan todos los días. Entonces, ahorita no te vayas, no te vayas a otros verbos más técnicos. Vete sí. a lo básico, porque tú estás iniciando, tú necesitas expandir tu conocimiento. Entonces, entre más palabras y verbos tú sepas, mejor. Lleva un orden de las cosas. Hemos visto preposiciones. Pon las preposiciones en, en un ladito, right? Pon los adjectives. Hemos visto adjectives, ¿sí? Hemos visto verbos. Entonces, todo eso, las, las terceras personas, los progresivos. Entonces, eso te va a ayudar a crecer definitivamente. Y no, no, no te preocupes porque sé que la dinámica de la clase, yo creo que nuestra dinámica está bastante arriba de las expectativas, para serte honesto. Uh -huh. Por mi experiencia te lo digo, que usualmente estas clases tendrían que ser 50% español y 50% inglés. Pero nosotros es como que vayamos como que 90 inglés y 10 español, ¿me entendés? Entonces, en, en cierta medida es mejor, eh, Víctor, pues tu oído se está súper educando a eso. Eh, tu chip, ¿verdad? Tu cerebro se desconecta del español para definitivamente incorporarse al inglés al más no poder. Donde tú tienes que mentalizarte a no depender de tu español, Víctor. Lo poquito que tú sepas, tienes que decirlo, right? Y si te equivocas, I'm sorry. Can you repeat that again? Aunque, me, aunque, aunque te repitan otra vez, pero tienes como que un, dos oportunidades para lograr captar la pregunta. Hay veces nos frustramos en la primera. Ay, no, no entendí. Ay, no, I don't understand. No. Repeat, please. Hey, repeat one more time, please. Si hasta al pedirlo de buena manera da gusto, right? Entonces, a manera de práctica hay que hacerlo. En lo All que right. me he quedado un poco es en los, ¿cómo se llaman? Los in, in, on, at, pero de lugares. Eh, lo vi aquí porque yo he impreso esto, lo, lo, del, lo del manual de estudiante. Ah, lo imprimiste, ok. Sí, lo que es la unidad 1. Y lo vi, más o menos la explicación que sale, pero lo de los lugares no me queda, no me queda muy claro. Lo de los, con hora y todo eso, sí, eh, fechas. Para, para el lugar, tiempo, dices ya. tú. Eso se llaman prepositions sí. of place. Of place. De, como, como lo bueno Exacto, que en inglés, no... estas prepositions of place son las mismas que se usan con el tiempo. Entonces, tienen, tienen ese uso, ¿verdad? No, tienen, no son como en español que hay diferentes. Entonces, las mismas que usas para el tiempo, las usas sí. para el lugar. Entonces te voy a mandar ahorita okay. un link. Prepositions of place. Sí, la verdad que las preposiciones son bien complicadas. Son bien complicadas. Eh, pero vete haciendo como, como hay que categorizarlas, ¿verdad? Sí. Hay que categorizarlas y poniendo ejemplos. Quiero ver, este está muy complicado. Déjame verte otro acá. Y te vamos a mandar un video. Let me check. Realmente sí, teacher. Ha sido bien extenso y sí, o sea, como usted dice, va, es como bien intensivo, pero quizás tiene la ventaja de que uno del gran, de, cuando es bastante, uno toma, o sea, agarra lo más posible, ¿verdad? Sí. No es así como que va muy lento y no se, no se cubre nada de todo lo que... Porque yo igual, yo intento y voy a... O sea, yo escribo y tomo nota de lo que, de lo que yo entiendo. Y lo, la dinámica que tomo hoy, o sea, le, le da la pregunta a todos y en lo que otro contesta, yo estoy aprendiendo de lo que contesta. Correcto, correcto. Es que vamos poco a poco. A, antes era de dos en dos, para que todos iban agarrando la idea, entonces mm. la presión eh, en esa forma va creciendo y como tú dices, eh, es el aprovechamiento del tiempo, ¿verdad? Mientras tus compañeros están, repite y repite, tú estás tomando nota. Si no, tú no la aprendiste al 100%, aprendiste la, la, la pregunta, la entendiste un 50%, la vuelven a repetir y ahí vas. 
right? La chateamos sí. en el chat. Ah, entonces, ahí está. Entonces, poco a poco, right? Es que yo creo que nos pasa, prácticamente a los que estamos en un nivel un poco más abajo, nos pasa lo mismo. Lo entendemos cuando lo leemos, pero el oído lo tenemos un poco. Por ejemplo, hacer las preguntas, ya cuando uno lo quiere armar una, una frase, no puede porque como no tiene mucho vocabulario, no maneja las, las, ¿cómo se llama? las conexiones, ahí es donde uno se queda. Están las conjunctions para unir las cosas, están las conjunctions y están las prepositions. Entonces, siempre y cuando tú, ah, este, te va, este está bueno, aunque mira, este está largo, pero lo puedes ir viendo por partes, quizás en tus breaks, en tu lunch, le das unos 10 minutos, sí. tomas nota, y aquí está, mira. Quizás vete al video, eh, vete al video, guárdame esos links, puede guardarlos o te los mando al WhatsApp. Uh, ahorita los voy a copiar en un Word eso. Ok, okay O okay. si los puede mandar al WhatsApp más fácil. Va, te los voy a mandar ahí también para que les quede a los demás. Sí, en el grupo para que quede. Y ahí pues tú comienzas a practicar, ok. Y si tienes alguna otra duda, me avisas, ok, sir. No solamente, pues la verdad es que estoy tratando de, por lo menos las tareas las llevo, creo que solo. No, hombre, ánimo, de... ánimo. A mí, me, a mí me consta que tú te estás rebuscando mucho y yo he visto tu progreso también. Los primeros días estabas más callado, ¿sí? sí. Día a día has ido eh, mejorando tu participación. Entonces, ahorita está ideal. Estás activo. Cuando se te pregunta, respondes. Entonces, tú estás cumpliendo. Víctor, sigue en el mismo, en la misma uh, tendencia y vamos a ver buenos frutos muy pronto, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. See you tomorrow, sir. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good evening.